Welcome back to Elevate Yourself Tarot Water Signs. What up, peeps? Um, Scorpio Cancer Pisces. So here we go. I'm going to do a little reading for you, blessed for success, because you are starting with this card, Star Seed card deck. Starkeeper Cosmic Ancestors Seed the Light by Staying Grounded. You are the Star Keeper. You do have a powerful third eye. Who am I doing? Scorpio first? Yes, sexy Scorpio. You're not for everyone. Yeah, I did a pre-shuffle, just meaning like you clear it for the, the sign you're going to do and see what pops up and the same shit pops up, so that's cool. But so it says, you're not, you're not for everyone. Embrace your weirdness. Face your true north. So, it's weird because I'm also fucking weird and uh, not for everyone. Or maybe I am. But, uh, so I totally get it. <laughs> but it's saying to yourself, stay authentic. Inner earth. Yep, another. You'll survive this. New solutions and beginnings. Okay, you are blessed for success. See a new perspective. Instead of seeing the sun from the stars, see the stars from the sun. I don't even know what I just said. The courageous peony. So that's a, oh, that's a flower. Um, it represents prosperity, romance, happy marriage, riches, honor, compassion, and also bashfulness if you're shy. Multifaceted, unique nature. Let yourself be seen. Right? New perspective. You are a star seed. So I'm just using the angel deck now. Just to see you get a message, and then I'll do a shocker for the clearing. Alright. Oh. Hopefully my hair isn't jacked up. I put this in necklace on. Fuck my shit up. So the high priestess. You are, um... You are the high priestess. You are all-knowing. You are intuitive. That's a sign of Scorpio Pisces. I mean, a sign of Pisces, Cancer. So, uh, there will be a renewal. Archangel Jeremy helps you to release uh, your future fears and transform and heal you. Because there is love or emotions moving quickly at you creating unity, and it's going to create unity and give you strength. Strength uh, is like the lion sign of Leo. Um, you do have a choice, power, solar plexus, yellow, rom. I'll tell you, clear it, and uh, so possibly dealing with a Leo. Archangel Sandalphon is on there, That though he takes your prayers from earth up to heaven <laughs> be present uh, be present be aware because with that be in the corner which means wealth prosperity you know that that is in your future sites it is there because you're growing and nurturing these new seeds of of want and responsibility creating found um, stability and structure within your family with the root chakra red. You clear that by LAM. Lom. Good stress on that. <laughs> All right, and fulfill your sexual desires with the orange sacral chakra. Okay, so I'm going to do cancer. So clear for cancer, you are blessed for success. The whale, whale and orica elders. Share your song, frequency, sound. Diving deep. So dive deep. Listen to those who are older and wiser than you. Um, because you are being called to do so. However, take it within baby steps. Because somebody does want to say sorry. All right. Through this karmatic relationship represented by Orion, wisdom and knowledge for mastery, so learning. 
wisdom and knowledge. Um, and the peony, that flower of wealth and romance, prosperity, is creating a canvas for your life. And you're going to get a message of it because you are a child of the cosmos. So, so stay connected, stay aware. I was going to stay grounded. All right. I'm going to do the angel deck. And again, this is Cancer. Or if you're a stalker watching, cautious Cancer. I feel it. You do gain the world. You do gain the world as an outcome, Cancer. Your foundation and st you will move quickly toward your foundation and stability. It will it overlays and overlaps that. Um, with the ego card coming out, you are spending you know a lot of time being really concentrated and focused on your material world and needs. Being the emperor, being the boss, and a man in position of power, control, a father, uh, also possible son of Aries. Archangel Michael comes up again. He's the archangel of protection. If you need so, mentally, emotionally, physically, spiritually, sexually, monetarily, or any other way you do so need so, call upon him. Like I'm doing a commercial. <laughs> uh, because with that, you do have the completion of the cycle with the nine of air, allowing you to be at the end of being up in your mind about the situation, using your intuition to do so. <clears throat> following your guides and your dreams out from your third eye and your crown chakra home <gasps> fulfilling and following your desires and keeping your home balanced and secure with the red root chakra through creativity through creative means that's the solution is those chakra cards That's your story. <laughs> Tyler's Tarot, he's fucking hilarious. And everybody in that mama is talking about that man. All right. Pisces, precious Pisces. Say hello to my best friend, Laura, for me. I haven't talked to that in a minute. Earth school, Pisces. Learning, life lessons, soul growth, study higher learning. So, you're blessed for success. You're going to be learning a lot of life, earthly lessons. But so you must learn them. You must complete them properly as to not have to do them again. See things from a new perspective. Instead of seeing the stars from the earth, see the earth from the stars. Who are you? This one again, the whale and elders, Orca. So... Signs being shown to you by people who are elder and more wise because you're being called to do so. Similar cards just came up for Scorpio Cancer or something, right? Because there is a void that uh, needs to be filled. There's a void there. And you must go into the inner earth to fulfill it and clear it. Your inner, inner earth, the inner child. The earth pulsing. This like sounds so perverted to me. Pulse of the mother. Slow down. Take time in nature. So go into inner earth. The water, the trees, the sun, the park, the bees. Oh, please. Take baby steps while you do it. Notice all around you is beautiful. All paths lead to home. Remember who you are. Remember your name. Like the movie Haunted, right? Who are you? He's like, I don't know. Well, in this case, you need to know. You know and you need to remember real quick. Pisces. The six of air. So communication. Um, communication with emotion and leading to a possible trip. Pos possible um, the star, possible Aquarius. But uh, a trip or a light travel. That's the word I was looking for. Sorry. The Queen of Air, dealing with the Queen of Air, uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or just being the Queen of Air, being, you know, like it says up here, independent, witty, realistic. I said all those words already. Um, <laughs> being very clear, very concise. Cutting through to the matter um, with communication, doing it with communication in your mind and out of your mouth. And again with the trip because she's holding a globe and there's a horse there in it. That's movement, right? That's called movement like a knight. 
So again, trip, travel, coming up. Seven of air. It will be spoken to you and shown to you through signs and synchronicities of your spirituality. That there is a third party. Third party energy coming up here in the earthly realm as an earth person. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. But um, And again, it doesn't have to be necessarily cheating, although it could be. But, uh, but also that's the Holy Trinity, mind, body, and spirit, and needing to balance the three. With the eight of air. More communication coming back around to you. So there's something that somebody... Is coming to say and uh, leading you to the hermit mode after that going into solitude meditation thinking wondering leaving yourself with a decision you're gonna need to make with uh, that you're emotionally attached with your sacral chakra here the chakra deck now just for clearance and clearancing and balancing clearance sale Balance your sacral chakra, that's between your hip bones. It's the color orange, and it is the mantra VOM, the AM VOM. VOM. And here is where you create and where you're inspired. All right, and while you do that, you visualize from your third eye, your crown. You think with those daydreams and those signs being shown to you, the synchronicities, the answers will be shown to you through your intuition, your third eye answer like i said the dreams pay attention to your dreams and uh take action and this will allow you to take action within your foundation and your stability with that decision needing that's what you're gonna have to make in the earthly real realm but this can also be a material thing right more green but this is a heart chakra for green do it from a properly emotionally balanced space and the mantra for the heart is Y A M Yum 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 <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna stop there. So that was for the Scorpio Cancer Pisces. Or if you're stuck or watching, thank you so much for watching. Elevate yourself, y'all. Your girl D Kizzle Poops. Bye.